Most of us, we don't know the meaning of relationship. Hatujui maana ya mahusiano. It's the biggest problem. Hili ni tatizo kubwa. I mean, na maanisha. For example, kwa mfano, in human relationship, katika mahusiano ya kibinadamu, man and a woman. Mwanaume na mwanamke. I mean human relationship. Na maanisha mahusiano ya kibinadamu. This relationship haya mahusiano that we call marriage tunaya ambayo tunaita ndoa is a relationship between a two weak people gather together ni mahusiano kati ya watu wawili wadhaifu waliokutana pamoja praise god hallelujah are we together so a woman knows i'm going to be married with uh, uh, a weak man kwa hiyo mwanamke anajua anaenda kuolewa na mwanaume dhaifu not a perfect man so mwanaume mkamilifu and a man is knows i'm going to marry na mwanaume anajua anaenda kuoa i'm perfect woman mwanamke asiye mkamilifu a weak woman mwanamke mdhaifu praise god hallelujah so, so so what 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 can make marriage to stand kwa nini kinachoweza kufanya ndoa iweze kusimama it's just to acknowledge ni kutambua his weakness udhaifu wake is my weakness ni udhaifu wangu and my weakness na udhaifu wangu his weakness ni udhaifu wangu that thing makes marriage to stand jambo hilo ndilo linafanya ndoa iweze kusimama but in the marriage lakini katika ndoa me I'm, I'm i'm right ukisema mimi niko sahihi me i'm not like you mimi sio kama wewe you find yourself doing something wrong with what you're self expecting utajikuta unafanya makosa ambayo hata wewe mwenyewe ukutarajia and it to be the end of marriage na ndio itakuwa ni mwisho wa ndoa hiyo but once each other you understand lakini mtakapoelewana kila mmoja and they carry on another weakness na mkabebeana madhaifu is very easy to go find the marriage ni rahisi sana hiyo ndoa ikaenda mbaya so you cannot count the wrong of your husband and the wrong why you always kuhesabu makosa ya mume wako na makosa ya mke wako i mean the the wrong of your husband na makosa ya mume wako always you be there to pray for him wakati wote utakuwa unamwombea because you know kwa sababu najua i accept this man and i knew this man is not perfect nilimkubali huyu mwanaume na nilikuwa najua kabisa sio mkamilifu so he can do mistake any time anaweza kukosea wakati wowote so meaning when we say somebody is not perfect tunasema meaning tunasema tu si mkamilifu tunamaanisha hivi he can wrong any time anaweza kukosea wakati wowote you know i'm saying You know there is some wrong unajua kuna baadhi ya makosa cannot expect huwezi kuyatarajia but he can do it lakini anaweza kuyafanya but if you understand lakini ukielewa that he can do any kind of wrong anaweza kukosea kosa lolote is very easy to live a peaceful life and to pray for him kuishi maisha mazuri na kuendelea kumpenda the same thing man to wife ndivyo hivyo pia mwanamke kwa mwanaume kwa mke wake i need to pray for my wife nahitaji kumwombea mke wangu because i know kwa sababu najua She is not perfect. Sio mkamilifu. She can do any wrong. Anaweza akakosea. She can have anger. Anaweza kuwa moja hasira. She can lie. Anaweza kusema uongo. She can do anything. Anaweza fanya chochote. But in all those things, lakini katika yote haya, I am ready to carry it. Niko tayari kuyabeba. The marriage go far. Na hiyo ndoa okay. itaenda mbaya. I mean, na maanisha, but this relationship, haya mahusiano between a man and Jesus kati ya mwanadamu na Yesu this is another relationship i mean is a relationship between someone who is perfect kati ya mtu ambaye ni perfect and is ready to carry all your weakness na yuko tayari kumbe mdhaifu all your weakness mdhaifu to thank you no matter what happens to thank you no matter the challenge this man is perfect he is not imperfect he is perfect he is always there to carry you yuko tayari kukubeba wakati wote to carry you kukubeba and he is not expecting you to be perfect na hatarajii wewe uwe mkamilifu this is another relationship haya ni mahusiano mengine this relationship is relationship between haya mahusiano ni mahusiano kati ya the perfect man to mkamilifu praise god hallelujah are we together and an perfect man na mtu asiye mkamilifu praise god so meaning nothing you can do that can make you to praise god kwa hiyo maana yake hakuna unachoweza kufanya you don't have any effort hauna jitihada zozote 
Just in relation in human relationship you wrong. Katika mahusiano tu ya kibinadamu unakosea. How about relationship between you and God? Itakuwaje kati ya mahusiano yako wewe na Mungu? Just in human relationship you wrong. Hata mahusiano ya kibinadamu unakosea. How about relationship between you and God? Itakuwaje unapokuwa na mahusiano na Mungu? One thing kitu kimoja that can make you. Ambacho kinaweza kukufaa. To remain in him. Ubakie kwenye mahusiano. Carry me O Lord. Nibebe e Bwana. Carry me. Nibebe I cannot stand. Siwezi kusimama on my own. Kwa jitihada zangu. Carry me all road. Nibebe e Bwana. Nobody knows me. Hakuna na yenichu. It is only you. Nipe, wewe Carry me all road. Nibebe e Bwana. Nobody knows my shame. Hakuna na yenichu. It is only you. Nobody can carry my shame. Hakuna fiibeba hiyo. Nobody can carry my wrong. Hakuna kubeba makosa. It is only you Jesus. It is only you. Niwape I run to you. Because I know there is no way there is no way there is no way you can leave my shame you can carry it you can carry it and you can keep it you can keep it you can keep, it. You can keep me that is Jesus so don't find to be perfect in you for you kuwa mkamilifu mbele zake you wasting your time unapoteza muda wako don't find to be perfect before usitafute kuwa mkamilifu praise god hallelujah sifu mungu hallelujah let him remain perfect acha abakie kuwa mkamilifu and tell him to carry you na umwambia kubebe wewe he will carry you atakubeba he will carry you atakubeba he will carry you atakubeba as he did on the cross kama alivyofanya na msalabani he not fail the same thing he will keep carrying us because we are not we are spirit man he can carry us anaweza kutubeba can carry us anaweza kutubeba and he cannot embarrass us na hata tudhalilisha he cannot embarrass us hata tudhalilisha yes ndio your wife mke wako your husband mume wako he can embarrass you anaweza kudhalilisha he can embarrass you Uh, brother there anaweza kukudhalilisha kwa ndugu zako kule even your wife hata mke wako pia can embarrass you anaweza kudhalilisha no, this i don't know this man huyu mwanaume atasielewa this man is foolish man mwanaume mpumbavu i don't know why accept him sijui kwa nini nimkubali i don't know sijui i don't know sijui let me check ngoja niangalie i will just leave her na wewe ndio nikaachana naye that the man but god lakini mungu he will never say it hata sema hivyo hana mtu mwingine akumwambia upumbavu wako Jesus yes hana mtu mwingine akumwambia upumbavu wako atautunza he keep it atautunza he keep it atautunza because he know the pain he know the pain of you anajua he know the pain of you anayajua maumivu yako he can feel your pain anaweza kuyabeba maumivu yako when you are crying Unapolia, in the time of wrong wakati wa makosa he understand your pain anayaelewa maumivu yako he understand anaelewa but a human being lakini mwanadamu there is no way he can attain your pain hawezi kuyaelewa maumivu yako and other na wengine they may think unafanya makusudi even if you are crying hata kama unalia but jesus lakini yesu he can carry you anaweza kukubeba is able to carry you anaweza kukubeba is a very big prayer in your life maombi mazuri kabisa katika maisha yako jesus nikumwambia yesu carry me naomba unibebe it's only you can carry me ni wewe peke yako unaweza kunibeba you know my inner wrong unayajua makosa yangu ya ndani mbona you know my inner wrong unajua makosa yangu ya ndani i don't know the end of my wrong sijui mwisho wa makosa yangu but carry me all lord lakini nikubebe e bwa save me all lord niokoe e bwa i will be saved nitakuwa salama heal me all lord I will be healed. Deliver me all Lord. I will be delivered. Praise God. Hallelujah. This kind of Christianity prayer. If you know ukijua the relationship that you are in, mahusiano ambayo upo, you cannot worry. Wewe kuogopa. You cannot worry. Wewe kuogopa. You cannot worry. Wewe kuogopa. You cannot worry. Wewe kuogopa because you know kwa sababu unajua Jesus yes he can carry you anaweza kukubeba he can carry you anaweza kukubeba in the time that nobody understand what you are going through wakati ambao watu hawaelewi unachopitia he can carry you anaweza kukubeba he can keep you anaweza kukutunza 
So it's very important to us. Why I'm saying all the things. All the things. Because I want you to know one Kwa thing. You need to be very deep Una in relationship. And to be confident. Na uwe na Pray, carry me. Omba, mwabia, no, omba, unibebe. Carry me. Nibebe. Carry me. Nibebe. Yeah, no, carry me. Nibebe. Keep watching POG Family TV. Jesus Christ loves you.